Hello everyone, it's Dom here from Esports News UK. I'm joined by a good friend of mine from the industry, Jack Jackalbat Freeman. You've done bits and pieces for Esports News UK in the past, Jack. Yeah. You're at Swipe Right PR now, dealing with teams like XL. You've got the XL viewing party coming up. What did you think of the match today? It was Golden Guardians beat um, PSG 3-0. I'm kind of upset to be honest, because I was really hoping for PSG to pull it out of the bag and get some good results against the Golden Guardians. They I swear, the drafts were looking so good for them if they could execute on them properly, but it just didn't work out in the end. What's just it like having MSI on the doorstep here? You know, I've been here, Worlds 2015 was ages ago. I don't know if you went there, but what's it like having it here? I mean, you mentioned it, like, uh, Worlds 2015 was the last time we're, it was here. So uh, when plans fell through, I thought, oh yeah, it, there'll be another one soon-ish, right? So yeah, and then Brexit happened, then the pandemic happened. Yeah, so now that I was back here, I went all out, like bought as like tickets for as many days as possible, uh, booked some time off of work, and I'm like ready here to just watch the games and enjoy. That's good stuff. What is your what's your um, views on how you think the bracket stage will go? We just had the bracket draw today. This video may go out a little bit later, but EU obviously got tough Korean opponents. <sighs> the thing is, as an LCK fan. I'll be, I'll be rooting for T1 all the way in Gen.G, but it's going to be an interesting one, especially since uh, if both Korean teams win, then that will mean uh, Mad and G2 in the loser's bracket, so that will be a fun time for everyone involved. Yeah. But do you think LCS, uh, do you think the North Americans can do all right, Golden Guardians? I've forgotten who they've Ooh. got now. They've got, oh, they've got BLG, I think. I'm so sorry, but like B BLG have like been storming the LPL. Mm. It's kind of like they did that miracle run to make it to MSI and I think they're going to use that momentum to just take it or I, I want to say all the way but at least a, a good distance mm. so unfortunately it's not looking good for the other teams yeah understood and I tend to agree what anything else you'd like to add Jack I know you're doing stuff with XO there's a viewing party on Sunday 21st at Platform Gaming Bar I've done a few events there I'm sure that'll be really good yeah anything else you want to add uh, yeah, so if you want to join the XL uh, after party, it'll be happening after MSI around about 7pm. I'll be there, XL will be there, some other cool people will be there, so you can come join us in all the fun. Yeah, because it's a viewing party in the day and then an after party afterwards, right? Yeah. And the viewing party starts at, what is it, 3pm, something like that? Or 1pm, I can't remember. Be when the game starts. I think it is 3pm. Yeah. Yeah great stuff jack always good to talk to you and you enjoy the rest of msi and i'll i'll catch you soon i'm sure yeah i'll see you around yeah no losses i don't do like both a few schools loose in the head i'm a psycho promise you the bar this is really the bite though careful not to get too close i might just go